is? It is, but you know, along here, there's quite a few little river crossings and some pullouts. Yeah. Um, you might be able to find just a, a nice little spot. Um, yeah, exactly. To do a little pullout. So it, it kind of goes, so just back to your, um, actually the board, like I'm really wanting to get to Glen Allen. Yeah. By Monday morning, if I can. Oh, yeah. quite a bit. Oh God, you do, eh? Yep, right down here. Well, oh yeah, yeah. So, um, we're gonna do the tilt cut off over yeah, the Yeah, then hang it right down there. Then I'll probably just knock this off. Go down here. Yeah. Probably go down there, catch the boat up. Okay. And uh, get up to Whitehorse, hopefully. Uh, right, right. Bike stays in shape by then. <laughs> so just kind of, you know. Okay, this is Peter. Yeah. He's three years older than me, and he's yeah. on his bicycle out here in the mountains of Alaska touring about. Right, and I'm, I'm cycling for a cause. What cause are you cycling for? Right here. Cycling, I do call it no tankers. Right down there, right? And what it is is that we've got um, Enbridge wants to put a big pipeline across BC from the Tarzans. And, the, uh, and that tar on the Tarzans in Alberta, right? Northern Alberta. Okay. That takes a hell of a lot of um, water and gas to yeah. produce one gallon. So it's a big... That's a big, yeah. it's a big bit of a kind of a, um, it's questionable. I mean, all those, it's, it's a secure uh, resource for the states and us. It's secure because we don't have to go anywhere for us in our backyard. But we don't, we want to keep our waters off BC. We're, we're, we're uh, questioning the tanker activity once it, it, all this crude shipped to, um, to not Prince George, to um, Prince Rupert. Yeah. That's where the port will be. So we really, we're really not wanting that. No, neither all the first, you know, the Aboriginal people, the First Nations people. Yeah. None of the bands, none of the, all across BC. And especially the coastal Indians, so, all, you know, the first people. So right. the natives don't want it either then? They don't want it. We just want it, you know, we know what's happened across, you know, we know the big oil spill that you people had to put up with. Mm -hmm. And how it's never, it's, the, the, it's minimal kind of mitigation. I mean, you go there and paddle around and dig a, dig a little hole, in the, you know, mm -hmm. along on, on the shoreline, mm -hmm. it definitely hasn't gone. Right. right. You know no, that. you can still go down to Prince William Sound and yeah. dig down this far yeah, and there's oil. Yeah. So, you know, so How many miles total are you doing this for? I'm doing 2,000 miles and this, um, I mean, this, these people, notankers.ca, there's a website for that and then there's, um, it goes on and on, right? There's yeah. that. And He's then, doing this for a cause, no tankers. Or BC or no oil tankers in our waters, right? It's not yeah. that, not, no. Those are ducks. Yep. Loons. 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 <laughs> so it's not That's like, a Canadian. Yes, of course yeah, it's not It's not like we're anti, I'm not anti, <laughs> I mean, I made a living for years. It's not like we're anti resource. Right. It's just that, is this the, op, is this the best way of doing it? Why, do you understand? Sometimes you need to think about stuff. Absolutely. You know, um, just like, for instance, you, you know, when you you that the pipeline that's being put on hold now keystone keep going you know bypassing your aquifer there right mm -hmm. you know that kind of thing mm -hmm. so we just need to have to, some options yeah to look at some options not just one way yeah and our and our uh, prime minister um, harper is just basically getting rid of all community process and in the throes of just legislating it pretty well right but anyhow um